Welcome to Summoner's Rift. Incredible miracle. It's taking on actually a pretty sizable one going in mid lane now. Huh. Yeah, Coco, well, he did force Frozen out of lane just a little bit right there. Uh -oh. There we go. Emperor's Divide oh. onto Lilac. Ambition trying to catch him. Lilac a bit low. Nice. And first blood goes to Ambition. Great catch with that explosive cask. Mad Life throws in the ultimate, but can't quite land it onto Frozen. Explosive cast to keep Lilac there, and Lilac remembers what it's like to be a pro player as he gets oh up first blood, and Roar Whoa. just gonna die to the blood flash auto. Thirsty Bard, Mad Life grabs the kill there. Maybe they'll click on him later and we'll find out. Oh, Frozen getting caught there. Ignar may save him, pushing Ambition away. Nope, that's a lot of damage. Frozen still life flashes over the wall now. And Tempered Fate hits him. Mad Life trying to get there for the kill. He's got to time the Q, can't quite hit it. Meanwhile, Lilac getting a bit low. It looks like Frozen's going to escape here. Whoa, Mad Life went deep for the kill. He couldn't get it. Oh, Mad Life. Well, I, re I respect the effort. Why not wear tap dancing shoes at this point, Shen? Oh, oh here's another survived. balance. Frozen's there. Gravity yeah. Field is down. Well, Ambition zoning out Lilac, giving Coco some time to finish off his mid lane opponent. Looks like that'll be enough. Ambition comes in to grab the kill anyway. He uses his ult to secure it. Oh. CJ zoning tempered fate. They caught Lilac, and they also caught the support as well. Can they do something? Ambition taking a lot of damage. Whoa, he actually goes down. Nice re-engage from Frozen, throwing down the Chaos Storm. Space in a lot of trouble, goes over the wall, gets exhausted, makes it out. Roar trapped against the wall. Emperor's Divide throws Frozen back into the river, and it looks like CJ has found the fight that they've been looking for. That's a double kill for Coco. Starting to come in for Space as well, too. He gets the double as well. And Mad Life just throwing in a magical journey. I'll probably get some more MR later, but it's not really a too terribly big factor for him yet if he just wants to elongate this split pushing phase and yeah whoa oh, flash body wow. slam nice all by ambition totally catch frozen frozen getting very low as well mad life coming in to get the slow to help space pick up that kill ignar trying to make something happen he gets caught trapped against the wall with that q from mad life ambition makes it out of the fight shy coming down to ult him just to make sure and now CJ is going to comfortably push into this mid lane. Oh, so comfortable. Oh, that's not so comfortable for Apple. Tries to ult away with that onslaught of shadows. Shy is going to flash show. Magical journey, although they're not really going to go where they need to go. <laughs> Tempered fate <laughs> dodged. I'm barred and I helped. Uh, not the best crowd control for engaging unless Mad yeah. Life can actually hit that Tempered fate. And try and make a pick right here. Oh, Roar well, gets that's gone. easy. Oh. Yeah, Mad Life. <laughs> Woo! Gets it. That was a wimpy woo, but you get the idea. Is there though? He's gonna try another steal. Would be a bit overbold. Here comes a TP. Yeah, Shen. they're gonna try to stop it. Shen coming in, tries to get the taunt down onto Frozen. Frozen pops that ghost to try to get away. Can't do it. So both summoners used by Frozen, and he still goes down. Nice zoning by Coco as CJ takes an easy second dragon. And they are so far ahead this game. Three turrets to one, two dragons to zero, 12 kills to three. Just get back in position. It's in not front that of the long. tower. I feel like Bard is always kind of yawning too, you know? Oh, and the pulverize on new ambition gets exhausted. Whoa! Ignar just disappeared, man. Lilac gone as well too. Another double kill for Coco. And nice tempered fate catches Roar, and that is gonna be another easy kill. Looks like they managed to barely take out ambition there, but Apple's gonna pay for it. Shy's still alive, and Mad Life picks up another one. They finally take down Coco, but magical journey. Oh, here comes Frozen. Get ready for the Q. Oh, he mistimed his Oh, I thought he mistimed his Q for a second. Barely hit that. Shy's like, is Frozen over there? Yep, yep, he is. Yep. Shy went for the Trinity Force. Hmm. He did. I thought so. Yeah. Whoa. Ignar gets caught. Explosive cask used. A lot of damage coming in, and Ignar taken out very easily. And now I think it's the time you start the Baron. Yep, they will. You know, with the changes to uh, Shen's passive and the fact that it's up more at later levels, it does increase his damage output pretty significantly. That's a good point, actually, when you think about that with the Trinity Force. Yeah, whoa! Meanwhile, IM comes in and has two people just get immediately vaporized. Apple on the run, a magical journey brings Apple to doom. Now back to oh, the yeah. Baron. That's right. Well, Lilac's like, sorry guys, I was in the enemy jungle. Couldn't help you. Oh, Shy is Rek'Sai hunting. Oh, nope, nope, not anymore. I was nope. just looking for Rek'Sai right now, making sure that there's not going to be a chance of this steal. Shy just, oh, oh, oh he's trying. Nice no, Shy was ready, yeah. There with the taunt, Lilac taken out. 
And Mad Life with yet another kill. And doing objectives only after they get kills. Well, here oh we go. Oh boy, Ignar tries to start something. Uh, Emperor's Divide just keeps IM trapped over against Space. Mad Life coming in. They've caught and frozen, and he's going to go down, even with that ult from Hecarim over the top of everything. I am just way too far behind right now. Space trapped against the wall there. Can he survive? Gets the kill onto Lilac. Will he actually be able to get away? A double kill for him. He does. Wow. Space makes it out. That was about as close as it gets. Mad Life picking up another kill in there, too. And so two inhibitors down, and everybody magical journeys out. Oh, never mind. Coco comes in for an Emperor's Divide. A little bit of missing communication for CJ there. Is the Zonia's enough? Tempered Fate. Coco comes out of the Zonia's after the Tempered Fate lands, though, so he dies. Meanwhile, Space a little bit caught, but still doing so much damage. Shy comes in for the Taunt to Apple to make sure that Space stays just fine, and it looks like that could very well be the end of the game. CJ only lacking Coco. Yeah, they're just going to push forward right now. And CJ, a lot of the stuff I've seen with the Bard, them uh, when they are trying to execute these team fights, looks a little bit, a bit off, off still. That yeah. was another instance where the Zonias wasn't entirely timed well with Mad Life's uh, tempered fate to get that initiation. But Roar just going to get stapled to the wall oh, goodbye. and go down, space with another kill. And there it is, the end of the game. CJ Entis cruising to a victory, 21,000 gold ahead at the end of that one. And welcome to Summoner's Rift. Incredible miracle, taking on. Yeah, would have certainly had that early pressure, but you know, maybe just saying, I'm gonna roam and said, whoa, action in the bot lane, Mad Life in space could be in trouble as Lilac is coming in from behind. Roar has the flash getting low, space grabs that first blood. And CJ actually turning this one around. Lilac getting very low as well, too, as Shy was able to TP down. Oh, Space gets knocked up just barely out of turret range there. That was very nearly a kill for Ignar. Yeah. Uh, last game. Still got the cleanse, got the flash out of Frozen. That's another win as we yep. start to scrap. Oh, Ambition gets knocked up. Apple able to get in there with the Onslaught of Shadows. Mad Life turns around, the W dodge. Lilac comes in, throws that time winder. Apple very low. A kill comes in for Mad Life. CJ turning it around. Coco taking some damage from that Chaos Storm, but Frozen just doesn't have a lot of damage in general yet. So CJ just kind of. Shy continuing to farm in this top lane. And a fight in mid. Lilac able to get out of that one. Mad Life flashing, though, drops the Tibbers. Lilac in trouble, and there's Space taking him down with the Phosphorus Bomb rocket combo. Oh, Nara comes in, or Ignar comes in with a big pulverize, but only Frozen there to follow up. They've got the Chaos Storm, but again, just not doing a lot of damage. CJ just kind of partying hard in that one. Apple in a little bit of trouble. Shy comes in for the Taunt Ambition, trying to follow up here. Roar pops that ult to get away. Where's the stun from Annie? Doesn't really look like it's loaded up just yet. Ambition comes in, doesn't connect with the Body Slam. They get the slow on Ignar. Oh, Shy going deep for another Taunt. Ignar forced to flash. Wow. Ambition really going for this, actually. Starting to wrap around. Oh, There's a lot the of body people slam. there. Yeah, that's right. Ambition could just get killed, and he will, yes. Wow, no, flashes away. There he goes. Ignar with the kill there. Shy comes in, taunt onto Ignar. Coke over the wall as well. Space there to add in the damage. Mad Life. It's definitely, definitely a challenging champion from like a philosophical standpoint, right? The way you play him is very different. Meanwhile, CJ tries to take this second dragon for them. I am coming in, head of pulverized onto Ambition, Sivral to activate it. Coco pushing people away. Space getting a lot of damage done here. Frozen coming from the side. He drops a Chaos Storm, but Space able to pick up that kill on the Apple, and CJ just taking apart this team fight right now. A couple kills come in for I am, but CJ still able to push them back. Well, CJ just didn't have great target selection right there, so they ended up with a lot of people at very low health on Incredible Miracle, but not able to actually finish the kills. But they're going to go for the Dragon 3v4. Oh, uh, it's a little bit risky. Here comes I am again, but with those ults out of the way, they can maybe do it. Lilac trying to get close enough to smite it. He stole the Dragon last game. Shy goes in for the taunt, and that helps CJ secure that Dragon. Frozen very low. Shy able to pick up the kill off of some damage from space, looks like. He's going to get a double, and now Ignar and Lilac come back in. There's a teleport for Apple, but he has to run immediately. Flashes from CJ. They want another one. Space. Picks up a kill in the fight. Shy, Coco chasing as well. Shy taunts ahead. Goodbye, Ignar. Wow, another double kill for Space. Yep. 
you know, that's another advantage of his passive being up more these days is he does do more damage to turrets over time. Apple getting slowed down. Yeah, they might be able to catch him here. Frozen and Roar coming in, though. Ooh, CJ may have overstayed their welcome. Onslaught of Shadows comes in, and Ambition Shine in a little bit of trouble. Oh, Coco comes in with a great ultimate. Lilac from the side, though. They've still got CJ low. It looks like a kill on Coco will be the beginning of this fight there. The inhibitor didn't go down either. So I am able to actually turn this fight around. Oh, nice double kill for Frozen. And so they save their inhibitor. They get a couple kills. CJ. Sheen procs also. Yeah. Great duelist. Oh, here comes Apple teleporting in. Nice headbutt pulverize and Mad Life inhibition. A little bit of trouble. Coco turns around. Where's that Emperor's Divide? W. Parallel Convergence doesn't add anything for Lilac. CJ able to kite this one out well. Now Coco goes in. Great Emperor's Divide locks up a lot of... LZIM and the kills start to come in. There's a double though for Frozen, but more members are falling on the IM side. Frozen getting very low. Shy looking for one gets caught by that gravity field. Ambition tries out, but Shy still picks it up anyway. And with Apple in trouble here, when this kill comes in, it's going to be an ace and certainly going to be at least one inhibitor for CJ. It's not going to be more than. Living is nice. Going to go in on to Apple while wow, pushing him back with that Emperor's Divide as well. After going in, bending the soldiers just a bit. Mad Life comes in, doesn't even really need to help. Shy ulting in, wants that assist. Oh, parallel convergence, no follow up from Lilac. And now the fight begins. Lilac getting in the back lines a little bit, but CJ just all over Frozen immediately. He goes down. Tibbers gets dropped, doesn't get a lot of stuns, but there's a double kill already coming in for Coco. Nice taunt from Shy. Able to use that Trinity Force to just burst down Lilac. And this one is all but over at this yeah. point. Yeah, I mean, I said slow and steady. That would have been the safe way to go, but they just decide to go all in instead. Oh, so you got to teleport onto a super minion from Shy just to keep it alive right there. And they continue to pile on through with the Emperor's Divide. Oh, Roar getting poked really hard by this Azir. And might not get the kill. Looks like they're happy with the Nexus. I think I would be too. And CJ takes a pretty dominating 2-0 over Incredible Miracle. Not a surprise, but for a CJ fan, good to see. Yeah, definitely very convincing win. as.